Hey guys, I just wanted to share why I will be voting for Dr. Woody Myers for Indiana governor. Um, not only do I think that he has the experience and knowledge for the job, I think that he has Hoosier's best interest at heart. Um, whenever I found out that Governor Holcomb's ride share system that he directly implemented, Southeast Trans, was killing Hoosiers, um, I decided I needed to um, say something. Um, I do have personal experience with this as a social worker. Uh, one of my clients who her husband signed off, her name's Carolyn. She had scheduled a ride with Southeast Trans a month prior. They were supposed to pick, him, pick her up at 1130 um, for an 1130 appointment on a Monday morning. And about 6 p.m. the Saturday before, they uh, canceled her appointment. Carolyn was in a wheelchair, so she had to have a wheelchair accessible van. Um, if you have Medicaid you, in the state of Indiana, you do have to schedule your rides through Southeast Trans, and then they uh, send your ride out to companies all over the state. Well, this is a broken system. The system was not broken before Governor Holcomb implemented Southeast Trans to the tune of $126 million. Um, the $126 million contract was is supposed to last for four years, and um, in this four years, numerous Hoosiers have died, such as Carolyn. Carolyn's story, um, 18 hours after she was supposed to be at the doctor, she ended up going to um, the hospital. She was transferred and put in ICU. She then had to start kidney dialysis, and... Um, she went to a long-term care facility, and then two weeks later, uh, she passed away. So in the span of a three-week period from missing one doctor's appointment where she desperately needed to go uh, because of Governor Holcomb's system that he put in place, she died. She, she's gone. Uh, it's not just her. There are numerous um, cases all over the state of Indiana of people missing rides, people being stranded, people being waiting out in the cold or the hot for hours for rides that never show up. Um, ask anyone that has tried to schedule a ride through Southeast Trans and they will tell you it's an absolute nightmare. So in addition to me thinking and believing that Dr. Myers is um, the best person for the job, this is my personal reason as to why uh, I will definitely vote for him over Governor Holcomb. I'm asking you if you have any loved ones that have Medicaid, please look into this and please do your research because it could be your parent or your child or your brother or sister, it could be their life on the line next. If they don't have a ride and they don't get to their appointment, um, then they could die as well. Um, if you have a child and the child needs to get a ride to a cardiologist, um, you schedule the ride plenty of time, the ride never shows up, cardiologist drops you, what happens? Um, your child doesn't get treated. Of course, the state is saving money because people aren't getting rides, people aren't getting to appointments, there's prescriptions and medical treatments aren't happening. Of course, the money's being saved because it's at the expense of Hoosiers' lives. So, anyways, I wanted to uh, tell you why I am voting for Dr. Myers and ask that you look into Dr. Myers and consider voting for him as well. Thank you very much. Have a good evening. Bye.